In this video, I'm going to show you how you can make a read-only channel on your Discord server. A read-only channel is one where only you can send messages in. And of course, you can add other people as well. But the majority of the server will not be able to send messages in this channel unless you allow them to. For example, this channel I have right here, which is like the welcome channel. Nobody can send messages in here unless it's me. You see... 300 people have gone through it and no one leaves any messages in there because it has a read-only configuration. So I'm going to show you how you can do that. So the first thing you need to do is, of course, create a text channel. So let's go to the plus sign and create a text channel. Read only. And that will be it. So now we have the channel created. I can send a message. Message. Right? But if I want nobody to send messages in, I'm going to right-click on this channel. And I'm going to click edit channel here. We're going to go to permissions and in permissions. Now we're going to do some tweaking in here. As you can see, it has everyone role and this muted thing, but you can avoid it. That's special to my server. So the everyone role means everyone that is in this discord server. So you have a bunch of permissions to tweak, but the important ones are here. So you have this one that says read messages. If we click on the X, we are basically denying everyone in this Discord server to read messages in this channel, which means that the channel will basically just disappear and it will not show for the people on the server. So that's not what we want. What we want is send messages. We want to deny everyone in this server to send messages in this channel. So if we click the X, now nobody can send messages in here. So we save the changes. And if we go to the server, as you can see, this person was able to send a message before I save the changes. But now if he tries, he cannot. So I'm going to try to view this channel as other people will. So if I go to the server settings, roles, and then view server as role, if I choose any other role, for example, Arcane, which is like a bot that cannot send messages, any other role that I select are not able to send any message. So if I want to allow someone to speak on this channel, for example, my moderators, I can go back to edit the channel permissions and we will need to add either the person or the role they have to make the exception. So for example, if I want to allow the people that boost my server to speak on this channel, I'm going to select the role, the boosters. That's how I have it. So as you can see, the everyone has the X, which means that nobody can send messages in this channel. The booster has nothing in here. If the bar is in the middle, that will mean that Discord will apply any settings that the everyone role has. But if we make a change on the specific role, let's say, for example, I put it on the check mark, that will mean that basically Discord will make an exception to the permissions that the everyone role has. You cannot delete the everyone role because it's basically default in every channel. So now the dope booster role can speak in this channel, but nobody else can. So if I go back, you can see that I can speak because I'm the administrator. So let's see this channel as everybody will see it. So let's click on the server settings. Let's go to roles and view as a role. So right now I'm looking at this channel as the everyone role. Basically someone that just joined the server, someone that doesn't have any roles assigned. So if I assign myself the role of the dope booster, you can see that now I will be able to speak because that role has permissions to speak on this channel. So I'm going to click select role and then check this dope booster one. Check. As you can see, now I can speak in this channel. So basically that's how you can set up a read only channel on Discord. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Have a wonderful rest of the day, my friends, and stay safe out there.